How do I set up my Wireless Brother printer with a router that uses security? Hi, Simon. Simon will help you set up your Brother printer to work with your PC and router that uses security without USB cable. Important! Please note that prior setup or installation of other Brother products on your PC may alter what is displayed on this video. Please be advised that this installation instruction video is for first-time setup. Before starting, Simon needs to know your operating system. Step 1. Obtain your router information. Before starting the setup of your Brother printer, you need to find and write down some very important information related to the wireless settings of your router. Simon will help you find that information. Let's find the name of your network called SSID also known as the Service Set Identity. Click on Start. Click on Connect To. Click on Wireless Network Connection. Please write down the information on the network line. This is your SSID. Next, let's find your network security settings. Since you already have set up your router, you should have your security settings. Forgot or lost the information? Consult your router documentation before going further. You now have all the necessary information to start setting up your Brother printer. Step 2. Establish a connection between your router and your Brother machine. Press Menu 722. It will show WLAN Enable On on the LCD of the machine. Press up arrow button or down arrow button to select On. Press OK. Your machine will search for the SSID. There might be more than one listed. When you see the SSID you wrote down earlier, scroll to it and press OK. Input the password of your network from the keypad of the machine. Note, the minimum allowable characters are normally 8. Press OK. When asked to apply settings, press 1 to accept. After a few seconds, your machine will display Connected and print out a WLAN report automatically. Press Stop. Step 3. Change the last three digits of the IP address to 240. Press Menu 7212. Press 1. Move the cursor to the last three digits by pressing right arrow button. Input 240 by pressing the keypad. Press OK. Press Stop. Note, do not change any number of the IP address other than the last three digits. Step 4. Print out the network configuration sheet. Press Menu 6 6. Press Black Start or Color Start. The machine will print out the network configuration sheet. Find and take note of the IP address in the IP settings section. Step 5. Install the full driver and software package using the installation CD. Insert the CD-ROM of your brother machine into the CD-ROM drive of your PC. Important note! During the installation process, some system security screens may appear and differ from the current process. Please select any affirmative actions, for example, OK, Yes, Next, Allow, continue, to progress the installation. Select your language. Click on Initial Installation. Click on Install MFL Pro Suite Full Driver and Software Package. At the License Agreement window, read it and click Yes. If you see the Nuance PDF Viewer Plus window, click on Ignore to continue. At the Brother Printing Device Installation License Agreement window, 
read it, and click Yes. Select Wireless Network Connection, check Custom Install, click Next. If you see an antivirus or firewall security warning message window, click OK or Next to continue. At the Choose Destination Location window, click Next. At the Select Program Folder window, click Next. At the Select Features window, keep the default selections and click Next. At the Register Your PC with the Scan To functions at the Machine window, click Next. At the Set Up Network Scan to Name window, click Next to continue. At the Network Search Type window, select Specify Your Machine by Address, Advanced User, then type in the IP address that you noted in the previous step, then click Next. If a security window appears, check the Always Trust Software from Brother Industries Limited box and click Install. At the User's Guide window, click Next. At the Online Registration window, click Next. At the Setup Completed window, check Set as Default Printer and click Next. At the Brother Software Suite Installation Completed window, select Yes, I want to restart my computer now and click Finish. Please note that you will need to reconnect to your network once Windows XP has restarted. Your driver is now successfully installed. You should now be able to print wirelessly. Thanks, Simon.